bend and cleave the easy tip. After having mounted the easy tip, most probably you will need to bend the easy tip. Please sterilize the bending tool prior to each use in order to keep the sterile conditions of the easy tip. Insert the easy tip into the bending tool, slowly sliding it into place. Then gently bend the easy tip to the angle that you need for best handling. In order to be able to keep perfect contact to the finger switch, you can rotate the easy tip for perfect use in the oral cavity. Generally, all types of sterile, delivered, single-use fiber tips have the proper fiber length in order to start working immediately without the need of adjusting the length prior to application. However, in some cases it will be necessary to adjust the length of the fiber. Please sterilize the fiber cutter prior to each use to keep the sterile conditions of the easy tip. Place the optical fiber of the easy tip in the fiber cutter. Press the fiber cutter together and release it again. Press the fiber cutter firmly, but do not squeeze the optical fiber. It is only necessary to create a small notch to produce a clean break when breaking the fiber at the notch. Then. Bend the optical fiber at the notched location. It will break at the notched location with a smooth, perpendicular fracture surface. The cleaving was successful if the light of the aiming beam projects a uniform, circular pattern. Put the laser into operation by choosing any preset treatment. As soon as the serial laser blue is ready, you could check the light pattern. To do this, aim the easy tip vertically at a white background. If the aiming beam projects no pattern at all, or only an uneven pattern, cleave another one to two millimeters. Now you're ready to work.